What's going on again everybody? This is Leroy from Buku Adventures and today I will be doing my first unboxing video. The things that I will be unboxing will be from Rip and Dip, their online clothing store, but there's also a store in LA. How I was first introduced to the brand was actually from Jamie. She used to see all their posts coming down Instagram, showed me all the shirts and stuff, and then all of a sudden Christmas rolls around. I'm opening my gifts and bam, a ribbon dip shirt. What I like about the brand is how they take figures from pop culture and make it their own using their character name, Norm. Nerd, sorry, nerd. Like the shirt I'm wearing now, this is the old school Power Ranger logo and it says Rip and Dip, so you just took it and made it their own. Also on the back of the shirt, they have a Goldar, which instead of Goldar's face, is actually Nerf. So from that point, just seeing, I was, number one, I like the quality of the shirt, I like the designs, and I also like the way it fit. Now me, being as tall as I am, to find a long sleeve shirt that fits me is a big blessing. So then, from that point, I've always been going on this site, I ordered a couple of things. I'm scrolling through my emails and I see that they're selling a mystery box for $100. That included five t-shirts, a mask, and 10 other accessories. And me personally, who just wanted to get my Rip and Dip game up, I thought it was a good deal because just with the five shirts, it's gonna equal out to over $100 anyway. And then I get a mask and 10 other accessories, I mean, why not? And the shipping was pretty quick too. I mean, I ordered it on Thursday and guide on a Saturday. So here it is right here, the $100 mystery box or bag. And let's see what's inside. Before I get into opening the bag, if you like our content, then go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Like the video if you like the video. And leave something in the comment section if you got something to talk about. Also hit that notification bell so you can know when we drop new content. Now let's get into this bag. Let's see. Uh, all right. I don't have any kind of cut or anything. It's got to just, ah, ah, Superman, ah. Don't want to damage nothing in it. Oh. All right, here we go. All right, all right. I think I'm liking what I see already. Got more stuff. He said a mask and up to, up to, and accessories, this is the mask. All right, I don't even know what this thing is, but okay. All right, I'm just gonna, bam. Man, this, I just keep pulling stuff out. They said up to 10, it seemed like it's more than 10. All right, and that's it. So yeah, so the box is, well, the box is supposed to have five t-shirts and a mask and up to 10. Accessories. So, let's see. one, two, three, four, five T-shirts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight accessories. What? Wait, wait, nine, nine accessories. All right, and a mask. So he did say they did say up to ten accessories. So they have nine. So I'm I'm Just I'm ten. pleased. The mask is no, no, they said five t-shirts, a mask, and up to 10 accessories. What? So, all right, so let's go through all this. Oh, just a side note, this video is not sponsored. I pay for all this with my own money. I just wanted to show y'all what will come inside of a $100 mystery box from Rip and Dip. All right, so we, yes, we have the yellow shirt. Let me see. Oh yeah, I like this one. This is, this is actually one of the ones that I was looking at online, so I got it as the, Oscar the Grouch, with their version of it on the front. It has that, another smaller Oscar the Grouch. And hold up, on this sleeve it says, one man's trash is another man's treasure. You gotta love that, you gotta love it. All right, that's cool. I will just lay this over here. Next shirt, this little red shirt right here. So yeah, it came with four short sleeve shirts and one long sleeve shirt. So that was my long sleeve shirt. All right. I actually have this sticker on my laptop right now. This is the alien. Carrying Nerm off. Wait, Nerm, right? Yes. Carrying Nerm off into space or wherever. What's the alien's name? So I can stop calling them alien? He might be alien. Alien Nerm? Yeah, I think he's alien. Okay, well, alien Nerm have another small one in the front. And also, if you put down its pocket, 
I don't know if you can see this, but they have Nerm being carried off into space inside the pocket. So on the outside of the pocket, you can only see this right here. So yes, I love it. So okay, that was the second one. Let's get into the, what is this called, a lavender? Get to this lavender one. Oh, hold up, wait a minute, this is another long sleeve. I thought it was one, well, that's the way That's the way it showed in the ad. If you look at the ad, you'll see four short sleeve shirts and one long sleeve, so I assumed, but you know what they say about people who assume. So, but I'm actually happy because I love the long sleeve shirts. Look at this one, all right. Rip and dip, old nerve in the front, and then in the back, got the whole, 90s court situation going on here. Yeah, it's a long sleeve. I'm very happy about that. Love long sleeve shirts. All right, we're gonna get into the white shirt now. Oh, let's see. What's this one? Short sleeve. Okay. All right, and this one, what it says from Rip and Dip with love. <laughs> Who's that supposed to be? Share. That's Nerm. Well, yeah, Nerm dresses share. Yes. In the front, it says. From rip and dip, from rip and dip, with love. Yeah, it's real nice. You want it? <laughs> so anyway, let's get into the blue shirt. It's my last shirt I have to open. Let's see, it's a short sleeve. <laughs> I don't know why it's made me laugh, but <laughs> I don't know. It just looked like some type of worshiping situation. <laughs> uh, oh man, I don't know. I don't know if I'm wearing that one much. It says rip and dip in the front. Yeah. <laughs> Moving right along. Let's see, we have, I might give this to Jamie. I'm not a big plush guy, but she loves plushes. We have the plush pen. You want, see, she wanted. it, see. Bam. It's a nice pen though, I like it. We have, I don't know why I had a feeling I was in the lanyard. But we have a rip and dip lanyard. Look like a rock and roll type of deal. Rock and roll font. Let's see my next thing. And with all their purchases, like with all your um, purchases, well online at least, they give you a free sticker pack. So, yeah, let's give you some stickers. I actually think I have these already when I ordered a shirt from them. Cause they got the Street Fighter stickers out. Give them to Jamie. Thanks. All right, and the next item will be, this is a snake <laughs> with a pelican head wrapped up around the neck. It's, 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 I don't know, it's a flamingo. Well, no, you know what? It's a flamingo. It just kind of looked like a pelican, like beak or whatever, but yeah. So it's a, it's a, it's a, yeah. So it's a flamingo snake wrapped around old nerve. So, our next item here. Let's see, we got a few more to get through. Let's see, we have an air freshener. Go good in the car. Yeah, yeah, that'll come in handy. Uh, yeah, how does it smell? I don't want to open it. I can't smell it, but I know if I open it, it's gonna, the smell timer is gonna start ticking. And the next item is, looks like a bookmark ruler. It says, stay in skew. Well, SK3 W school school stay in school and you know I can use one of these things I actually just started writing a little bit more so this will definitely come in handy we have what is this look like a stencil set or something it says don't effing tag this blank on anything that isn't your own property and don't hit me up if you get in trouble. <laughs> it really says that, see, right here. <laughs> so yeah, it's like a little stencil set. I'm not even really sure what I would do with it quite yet, but I'll do something with it. Moving right along, I have what looks like there's a camel beach ball. A camel beach ball. It says rip and dip. I don't want to blow it up right now, but you know, you will see when I do. My last accessory is a little notepad. 
like I said, I just started writing a little more and starting to get more organized. So this will definitely come in handy. And I have my mask, filtered face mask. Pretty nice, pretty nice. It's like a tie-dye type of situation. I like it a whole lot. Let's open this up to see how it fits. Cause I, 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 I've had good mask and I had not so good mask fit wise. So let's see how does this mask fit. So it has two filters in it. That's two filters. And look like it has adjustable straps. Fits pretty well. Fits pretty well. Definitely fits pretty well. I probably would prefer it to be a little bigger just because I like my mask to go right under my beard. But for the most part, it fits pretty well. It's definitely wearable and I definitely will wear it. So that was a $100 mystery box from Rip and Dip. It came with a lot of nice things. I'm a pleased customer. I paid $100 for about $250 worth of items. So I'm pretty happy. My favorite thing of the whole box was the Oscar shirt. I love the Oscar shirt. I like the yellow, I like bright colors, and I like Oscar. And I like a good quote when I look down on my arm. It says, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Not to put down anything else because I, I like everything I got pretty much. I mean, I would say my second thing, my second favorite thing, whoa, hold up. Gotta go with the share. Gotta go with the share shirt. Nice summertime shirt. And now I have a beach ball to play with at the beach. I'm a pretty, I'm a pretty happy customer. Thank y'all for tuning in with me with this unboxing. It was a lot of fun. I like all the stuff I got. And look, we have a whole lot more content coming out really soon. I mean, we we got a lot of things planned. Uh, we're actually moving in the area that will allow us to do the things that we want to do. We just try to make videos to show everybody the type of things that we like for people who could relate. So once again, thank y'all for tuning in with me, and we'll see y'all next time. Peace. Question. How the f do I get off of this level? Oh, so you just gotta like walk around. I walked around. Eh? You gotta walk around and you can only jump. You can't really. Oh, he can't jump. Wait, he can't jump. You're right. Yeah, you gotta go find all five of the stars. I see him, but I can't get to him because there's no way to get to him. Jamie, I'm shooting a video and okay, you're, you're making me talk you through Mario 3D World.